Okay, so it actually turns out that we had the thing that we needed. Hi, bye. Hi, bye. Hi, we're back. Um, <laughs> so I've just put the crank in the hole because it, it makes sense. With some effort, you are able to insert the crank into the hole of the small metal plate. It fits perfectly. Uh, Interesting. Yes. And uh, What does it do? Well, it, it brings a rat. Um, <laughs> it brings a rat. Turn crank. As you slowly turn the crank, a secret passage panel opens oh. to another passage. Or, you know, a secret passage opens. That, that, that works just as well. Bye, bodies. See you guys later. No. And now we go through another hole. This the lighting is just This one beautiful. has a sound that goes dong. Dong. No? Okay. You have... Uh, come upon some stairs leading upwards. You wonder where they might lead. Could it be into the Getty tomb? Will you find Franklin Mosley hanging around in one of these? Yes. Yes. Yes, you will. Ruby. You have entered a cold, dark tomb. Which is the opposite of a womb. From moonlight shining in through a stained glass window, you can make out the four vaults in the wall and a stone sarcophagus on the floor. Each vault has a nameplate above it. The tomb door is barred on this side. It looks quite beautiful, actually. Look, vault. Oh, vault. Cold. <laughs> Cold. The vault door is sealed shut. Above the door is an engraved nameplate. Look, nameplate. The nameplate reads, Mary Frances Crouton. Use mm -hmm. crowbar on vault. Let's desecrate everyone. You're not close enough. You're not close enough. You're not close enough. <laughs> you are not close enough, Laura. Yeah. Um... Maybe it's not this one. But you're supposed to be able to open all of them. Oh, for f you know what? The one that you really need is this one, but you're supposed to be able to use all of them, you know? <sighs> I hate messages like this. Try open vault. With crowbar, yeah. Okay, here we go. So I guess ah. uses you just keep getting it not close enough, which is stupid. You insert the crowbar into the small opening between the vault door and the tomb wall. You then pull with all your might with a large crack. The door pops open. Oh, that's oh. <laughs> I like oh. how Laura turned to the camera and like basically smiled. No. <laughs> pouch. 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 <laughs> Pouch. Nope. Pouch. There you we don't go. have it yet. <sighs> you remove the leather pouch from the vault and take it with you. Look. Pouch. Ooh! Look oh at the shad! Oh, um. <laughs> Pry vault with crowbar. Okay. Yep. What's in this one? I think it might be dead body. <gasps> Look, vault. You're not close enough. And you seem to be stuck. <laughs> the vault is open. <laughs> the vault is open. Well, I'm glad. Trending, you appear into the open vault. Oh, there's an old wooden casket in there. Oh. Look in casket. Yes. Have respect for the dead, Laura. Oh Look come on! Nameplate. He might have a silver tongue. Yeah, yeah. The name reads Thomas S. Crouton. Come on, game. Really? Laura. Laura. Laura, Laura what are you doing? Laura. No, I. Laura, I think you have Laura to go the other way. The right. that, that's stupid. That it's it, your stupid game. You're very stupid. Open the other one. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, well, I, I meant the one next to that. I, I'm going to get over there, but I figured since I was in this area. Right up and with Krapa. Oh! Uh, oh! It's Siggy's um, head all over again! 
Before Ziggy even happened. Uh, you're not close. I, I, I just love the idea of like Laura like doing these in the opposite direction. That you know that she's come back home and then she's met her friend Lillian from school and then gone out to a plantation and just be like, ah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yep. What they couldn't they couldn't even get this this poor lady a casket. What a revolting sight. You want nothing to do with that old skeleton. Especially now that you smashed its head. And you know what, bone meal? You could make a very nice pie in Quest for Glory 4 with that. Oh. Hey, Baba Yaga likes things. Um, uh, Vault. You, you make it into Vault. a pie. Pie open pie. Hey, with we should do that. Baba. We should do Quest for Glory 4 at some point. Um... You insert the crowbar into the small opening between the vault door and the tomb wall. You then pull with all your might. With a loud crack, it pops open. Lock in vault. Trembling, you peer into the open vault. Yuck, there's a skeleton in there. And I see its feet. Oh my gosh. The nameplate reads Claude Crouton. Crouton. Poor Claude. He, he sounds like a funster. And you know what? Save. Because we're not doing this shit again. Mm-hmm. So I think... Tomb oh. oh. Open. Uh, uh, can I open it? No, I have to go back the way I came. Is it? Yeah, yes. I just need, you should be able to take the, you should be able to unbar that door. You know? Actually, yeah. Let's see. Uh, I've never tried that, actually. I'm going to see if I can unbar it. Because you'd think if they had a vault, that someone might have decided to try and open this before now. Aha! You <gasps> grab the bar, holding the door shut and carefully raise it. Now the door is free. And you know what? None of the walkthroughs I've ever read have ever mentioned that. Ooh. Bitch. So now we're back here. Yes. I mean, I'm Dijon sure so, I'm Crouton. sure someone else has thought of that, but I I I know I've seen plenty of these walkthroughs say go back the way you came. And it just seems like such a waste of time to go back through the way you came. I think that's also because, partially because it doesn't actually show the door. No, it doesn't show the door. You just you just assume. And now and now we get to see Lillian. Lillian. Aw, yay. Lillian. Let's let's be a friend to her. Let's say okay, look. Whatever's happening, uh it's one third. Look now. at the what the hell is a chalkboard? What? What? Uh well you see Lillian? Uh Lillian's been marking down how many people have oh, died. Wait. We have a visitor now, darlings. Sit up straight now. Lily, you're not right in the head. <laughs> Our visitor is talking to us. Pay attention now. Ask Lillian about Lillian. <laughs> oh. oh, I'm caught up in some fantasy world. <laughs> well, what's the point of me being a... Like, she said, listen to me. She's not listening. Tell about um 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 Jules. <laughs> Tell I'm not, about I'm not listening to you. dolls. Tell I love them about dropping <laughs> the soap. <laughs> oh my god! Ah, tell about Clarence. No. I just wish that you could speak to her more and, like, she could say something nutty at least. You know? Yeah. Oh, what? We don't want any visitors. Oh, we don't want anybody to know our secret. Our visitor will have to leave. You'll have to go. We don't want to play with you right now. But, but Lily, you know you brought me here, right? Hmm. Maybe if we ignore her, darlings, she will go away. Hush. Um, okay. 
You know what? I think I'm gonna go speak to Celie. Actually, that I'm is not, so creepy. I might have actually missed Celie because it is one of those one of those two times that you can uh think. I think we might have skipped past speaking to Celie, but still, we'll go try and talk to Celie. Oh no! You know what? Because Celie's not in her house. Celie is in the chapel. That fine, fine piece of ass is in a chapel. <laughs> I'm gonna marry her. Mm. <laughs> I don't know why I have this narrative of Sully and Laura, but you know. <laughs> what a fine, you got a fine ass, Miss, L Miss Lara. Wait, she's not interested in kissing Rudy. She's not interested in kissing Jeeves. Yeah, yeah, she's here. It's almost 2 a.m. Ooh. Silly, why are you looking at your breasts? I'm just saying. Uh, I, I think I, I could I do with the breasts going up there. That was weird. I think I could do with a boot job. Oh, what are you doing here, girl? Some mad terrible is happening. Evil spurs all around us. I think we're going to die before the night is over. Ask about three, three. <laughs> There's nothing I can tell about that girl. Ah! <laughs> Voodoo harm for. Celine's not listening to you. She's visibly frightened and deep in prayer. I'm deep in prayer. <laughs> this game does not understand love. What is love? <laughs> Baby, don't hurt me. No, she ain't listening. See you later. Stay safe. Uh, we'll see you later, uh, girl. You keep that ass fine. <laughs> keep that ass in motion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, keep that ass in motion. It goes up and down. It needs lotion. It needs lotion. Oh, of course it needs lotion. <laughs> Laura likes... Oh <laughs> Laura likes that. La yeah, Laura likes a lot of things, though. <laughs> she, she thinks she, she thinks James is James is attractive, but uh, too strange to kiss. And Rudy. Oh yeah, he's attractive, Rudy. but kind of dull, or something. <laughs> I like how that when you walk past that mirror, it it does like a little pixel animation, so it's sort of like it recognizes mm -hmm. that you've walked past a mirror. Bam, bam, yeah. Bam, bam. The guys who did the graphics on this just this is amazing. Oh yeah, this is this is AGI at its, at its best. Now, Rudy, are you are you going through stuff here? Yep. Oh. Act eight. The last the last act. We're Hi, very Rudy. close to the end. R yeah, Rudy. Yeah, Rudy Patuti. Rudy. Hello. Better ding. Oh there we go. Are you going to pray, Mr. Rudy? <laughs> no, he's looking under the bed. Beat it, kid. This ain't nothing of your business. You're down None on your, your knees like a common hooker. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. No, that, oh, actually... you got a fine ass. I'm just, mm. I like to see it going. That uh, That's my stuff. Okay, you, you done now? Or are you going to look under my dress? Oh. All right. And, and he disappeared. We're going to cut it here because this last act is uh, kind of short. And uh, I think it will only be one more video. And we're almost at 15 minutes. So uh, we'll see you guys next time with more Laura Blow. I mean, Laura Bow. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Hey, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you'd like to, please subscribe to my channel. I post new videos every day. And if you'd like to see videos before they hit YouTube, please consider my Patreon campaign. It really helps out on my game development while I make a lot of bames. Um, yeah, see you guys tomorrow. Bye-de-bye.